It's really interesting. It's, it's talking about how do we take the customer's problems, how do we take the information from a machine or from a uh, dealer system or from a customer site, and how do we use that to look for insights that help solve customer problems. About 15 years ago, I remember connecting machines up and having information flow from machines into the, not the cloud in those days, but into a Lisa database. So it's been going on a long time. I think the development and the uh, advancement in algorithms and analytics has really helped to take raw data, which isn't very useful, and really advance that opportunity to make clear insights that can help customers be more profitable and, uh, and more productive with their, with their assets. We have several sites around the world working. One site we have over 50 trucks running and they're expanding that out to 80 trucks. And what they're seeing on that with the unmanned trucks, the autonomous trucks, they're getting about a 20% uh, production improvement over a manned fleet. So they're really making significant gains because of it. Since 2012, we've had a really tough time in the industry. The mining industry has been down, as we know, globally. And so I think the silver lining to that is it drives customers and suppliers like Caterpillar to find innovative solutions to improve the performance of the customer's operation, build a better bottom line, get more efficient, more productive with less assets. And so really technology and digitalization has really grown through the need for innovation in the industry in these difficult times. As part of our digital strategy, we're working with simple things like a small operator how do you do labour capture? How do you know to assign the labour to the machine when they're working on the machine? How do we improve operator efficiency in terms of understanding how they're operating the machine and then giving direct feedback? All the way to semi-autonomous applications where we can auto dig or control grade very simply to help less skilled operators do a more skilled job. And then all the way up to full auto automation as you can see in the large mining trucks. So I think the journey is what degree of uh, technology you need and digital um, capability, and then how do we make sure that we give you the right solution for the needs you have.